Join me today on this episode of Overanalyzed. Woo! Jack, let's see what the master folder has in store for us today. Ah. We're going to do You're So Vain by Carly Simon. 1973. This is one of those weird songs that because of the tempo of the song, it seems a lot longer than it actually is. Also, I do not recommend watching the music video. It, it's disturbing. We're going to start at the beginning, like most, most things, unless you're Quentin Tarantino. Let's break it down. You walked into the party like you were walking onto a yacht. This this just shows how, how comfortable the the person is in all situations. You walk onto a yacht, just like the same way you're walking into a party. You, you, universal. Universal entertainer. Universal individual. Your hat strategically dipped below one eye, my lady. Well, that's a, that's a well-thought-out dresser, is what that is. And uh, your, your scarf, it was apricot. So, right from the beginning, what we have here is a gentleman that's comfortable and a, a good dresser. Nothing nothing vain so far. And the next block here, you had one eye in the mirror as you watched yourself gavotte. Gavotte is a dance. Now, if I were self-conscious about the way I dance, I might want to check, check in the mirror. Just a little, little peek. Okay, make sure I'm on point. Then it's just somebody that's conscientious. They're maybe they're a little nervous. Still, nothing, nothing vain. After that, uh, and and all the girls dreamed that they'd be your partner. They'd be your partner. And dot dot dot. The individual here is attractive, which is is presenting a problem for Carly Simon. We hit the the chorus. You're so vain. Probably think the song the song is about you. You're so vain. Don't you, don't you think the song is about you? A bit disillusioned? Jealous much? You had me several years ago when I was still quite naive. Carly Simon used to date this individual. Noted. When you said that we made such a pretty pair and that you would never leave. That's, that's a nice thing for, for someone to say to their partner. Uh, seems, seems to be a, a good individual. But you gave away the things you loved, and one of them was me. The, the individual seems to have had some sort of life change, and they're becoming more selfless. Less about the materialistic. Could be, uh, could be becoming a uh, Buddhist. I had some dreams. They were clouds in my coffee, clouds in my coffee. Uh, I think Harley just had a, had a slight break and her psyche we go on to the chorus with more disillusioned jealousy i had some dreams there were clouds in my coffee i get so again with the mental break um and the chorus again you're so vain you probably think the song is about you so like jelly for no reason at all well i hear you went up to saratoga and your horse naturally won. Because why wouldn't it? Then you flew your Lear jet up to Nova Scotia to see the total eclipse of the sun. Carly Simon is stalking this individual. There is no way Carly should know all of this. In 1973, there was no social media. Well, you're where you should be all the time. And when you're not, you're with some underworld spy or the wife of a close friend. Wife of a close friend. A, a little unhinged that someone they were with is with someone else now. Of course, you're so vain, you probably think the song is about you. You're so vain, bet you think the song is about you, don't you, don't you, don't you? You're so vain. This goes on for some time. It appears to be a, a spiraling depression. 
uh, Carly is is not doing a great great job dealing with this breakup. <laughs> so just to break it down, as we do. Carly Simon is attempting to make a point that the individual is quite vain, and what we have is the individual is comfortable in all situations, a well-thought-out dresser, a concise dancer, women find them attractive, uh, they used to date, Was so the individual was very good to Carly, uh, and then decided to pursue a, a life of less material objects. Just continuing, continuing the life, life after, life after Carly. Uh, but Carly, uh, she, she's, she's very jealous, a bit of a stalker, a little disillusioned, a few mental breaks, and quite depressed, a little hateful, sprinkled on top there. I mean, you're so vain, Carly. You're so jealous. Thanks everyone for stopping by. We do have Volume One still packed with many songs just begging for the overanalyzation. Like, share, subscribe. We're going to be doing this every week.